The Verizon project was brought to us as a potential initiative to be on our campus. We jumped right on, we were so excited. We're three months in and it's to the point where that new toy feel is gone. So the kids are less like trying to find ways to get around our system. But I really didn't expect when that newness to go away that they would start seeing the value of it as a tool. The thing I like most about my iPad is doing sketches. One thing I would like my teachers to use more in class would be iMovie. The biggest thing that surprised me right now is that the teachers are starting to push their own boundaries. Yesterday I was using a new component and it kept messing up and my kids are like laughing. They're like, it's okay, you'll get it eventually. And she, they were right. And it was neat that they were teaching me, but that's one of the things you run into. Even when you try to plan for every little thing, which is that's the type of person I am, it doesn't matter because with technology you never know. As a teacher in general, I feel like things are always changing and it just shows how versatile a lot of us are. The students as well, I think especially with technology, they're all kind of understanding that we're going through this process and learning together. So that has freed all of us teachers up, at least it freed me up, that I am allowed to make mistakes and learn. And that's what being a teacher is all about. Since implementing the technology, I've seen a lot of kids that may not have participated beforehand are starting to participate, are starting to collaborate because they feel confident. The yeah, iPad, I feel like, just gives them a little bit more courage or just kind of empowers them to like, all right, I can try it more. Now that I've been posting the videos for them to access independently, a lot of them, since they've gotten the iPads, have been watching the videos outside of the classroom and they were coming in prepared for the material and then being able to spend more time working on it. We really are trying to get our students to be self-sufficient with the iPad. So what I'd love to see is just more of the student-directed projects or student-directed learning happening. And that's really where I feel like we need to grow. We want our students, our children, to be able to stand on their own two feet. One of the things that I like to do more with my iPad is doing bigger collaboration projects in front of our class and be able to do it with multiple people other than just doing it by yourself. We're in a community that we need to make sure that our students are prepared just like the rest of the world. Sustainability is something that's always on my mind for every program, but we want it to be embedded. We don't want it to be, oh, this is a program that we have. We want it to be like, this is who we are. If we just keep holding the control, how are they ever going to become the amazing adults they can be?